It's around 2 o'clock at the moment, very hot in Malaysia, maybe 35 plus degrees and I went for a run and I went to a run because I need to increase my fitness. I feel that I'm not so fit and before I went to run I was thinking to myself, oh maybe you shouldn't run. I was making up excuses in my head. I said maybe you shouldn't run because it's hot, you're going to get sunburned, it's not good for you. Um, it's too hot, just wait for the afternoon. And I was like, nah, sh stuff that. You can't make excuses, let's just do it. And now that I've finished, it wasn't so bad. It was just getting started that was difficult. And I was thinking to myself, doggy, doggy. And I was thinking to myself, I was thinking to myself, the majority of football players are weak. And, you know, myself, I'm playing at a pretty good level. And I know personally that my fitness, my strength, I'm only probably like 50% of where I could be. And if I'm playing at a good level, and for you guys out there that want to reach a professional level, you're so much behind. If you look at like Mike Tyson, the way he trained, he was getting up at 4.30 in the morning. How many of you guys would be doing that, getting up really early in the morning, go for training, and then go to sleep, just focus on football in the afternoon training again. That's the difference between top athletes and amateurs. Another example, as I was running, there was a pull-up bar. I bet the majority of you cannot even do 10 pull-ups, proper pull-ups, slow and up in a row. And that just shows you how weak you are. There's so much that you can be doing more and really consider that. It's so easy nowadays to be on your phone and not work out and you can make up excuses the rain you know maybe your mum says oh uh, you shouldn't go out son because it's gonna rain you're gonna get sick don't listen to that you need to harden up for myself as well I played at a good level and I know what I was lacking to make it into the next level I should have worked on more of my shooting and now that I'm getting older I realize what it takes to be a top professional if I knew this when I was younger then I would have been a much better player. And as you can see, my development over the last couple of years, I'm going up because I know what to work on, I analyze my games, I do all the things that a professional should be doing. So just keep that in mind, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Until next time, ciao.